Okay, so I'm uh, testing my ancient warriors with more than 100 raiders. So I have 316 population. And we have a raid. Let's see how many the destruction that this one is gonna give is going to give me. These are just a few and we have here. So I changed the script to have hundred more, uh, more than hundred raiders at three hundred population. And here is our defense here, and it's very light compared to my other games like the um, Scotland, uh, Hard Reality Scotland. And uh, I have a lot of resources, so uh, we will see how this uh, defense works uh, with uh, more than hundred raiders. And so far, we killed 11,270. So, 270. Oh, look at that. Those are my raiders in this uh, scenario. Very ancient warriors. It's like a snake, it's like a centipede. Look at that. Uh oh, oh, this is not nice. They are destroying my uh, houses here. Oh, that's not nice, Papa. So I have to, you know, kind of not build over there. So this one is safer, probably. So I don't know when uh, this one is going to be. It's so, all right. All right, let's see. Oh, this one was not destroyed. So here. What's going on here now? So wow, look at that. Ancient warriors. Um, I call it very ancient warrior scenario. 270 now, they killed three, four, five. It's a lot. All right, come on, go after them. Don't spare anyone there. All right. So I lost a lot here already. So, and the game is not lagging. Oh, wow, some of my fighters are playing too. All right. All right, that's enough, that's enough here. Yeah? Over here. All right, go after him. This one first. That's a sure... Uh, Dead. And how about this one? Come on, don't spare this guy here. All right, this one too. All right, you cannot. Uh, uh, what's this? Uh, uh, this one. Two hundred seventy. This one fa uh, already fled. How about here, oh, we have another playing one, five, six, seven, eight, eight, maybe nine, eight. How about this one? Come on. All right. Around 10 fled. 10 is my estimate. So four over here. Four. Alright, uh, eight, eight, where else, ten, ten managed to flee out of two seventy, so two seven zero, six, two, 126 plus 10, so 136 Raiders. That wasn't bad. 
All right. So it looks like okay. What is what is the destruction here? So they only managed to destroy some palisades, which uh, can easily be uh, what's this repaired. Well, our workload becomes high. So I also changed the immigration so that we can have on birth so that we can have easier population and just trying to enjoy this a uh, little bit of uh, different uh, type of scenario since uh, you know mostly ancient warriors have only like up to 40 something raiders so this time we managed to have like how many okay never mind about the sickness here the infection well Oh, well, if we can save them, we will try to save them. How about this guy here, lady? Come on, lady. Can you rest here now? Yeah. So we are rebuilding. I guess I have to adjust... Uh, I don't know. I'm gonna try more on more melee units. With a little bit of uh, uh, range unit support here. Seems like melee units is more uh, uh, effective with the raiders since uh, swords has a lot of uh, damage too. Yeah. So look at that. Fighting is four, and while this one fighting is three. But I will still try to equip my units with more um, uh, swords. Who is this here? Lady, can you can you just heal yourself? Okay, I think you have a chance to heal. So that was fine. 130 raiders. So still, this is the same um, uh, ancient warriors. Uh, uh, what's this settlement that I had? Actually, it's very ancient warriors. In uh, which uh, previously we have few raiders, and I normally don't have uh, deaths during raids, so it's kind of help uh, make more interesting. Okay, we have a trader, so my bones here are useless, as well as this. Uh, oh no, no, uh, yeah, no, yeah, and we have wow, we, I have a lot of uh, okay, I can buy this one, so I will dispose my leather. I have a lot of leather. Five, nine, okay, I can get that. Uh, how about my straw? Well, my straw is very limited. So I might add up a little bit here. Yeah. I'm not sure where, but I have to try. Yeah. There's no more area for planting uh, a lot of uh, grains. Probably here. We'll see. Maybe barley here. I don't know. I don't like to plant something like this with only two. I want something like uh, more. Yeah. Oh, here. I can plant here. No, I, that is a sacred ground. So I'm going to just make it a burial. Or maybe not. In case, yeah. I will just try to find uh, another spot for burial. All right, this one here, I want to try to modify this side here. This is nice over here already. But this side is uh, almost being attacked. Uh, maybe I have to remove the... Maybe I have to remove the bridge here. I don't know. Maybe I'll just try to modify this bridge to go this way. Yeah, all right, I can modify this one. Uh, never mind. Yeah, I'm trying. So we are spring, and my population is 297, capable of uh, holding 329, and one house over there was destroyed. So I'm gonna, I'm going to rebuild one here. Yeah, I'm going to make a hut, not a, not a. Where did he manage to? To destroy it I don't know where oh, here okay maybe here I can build one and they're not going to destroy it I don't know okay 
Okay, I can make a brown house here. What's happening? Why they're going there? What seems to be? Oh, the logs. Oh, I made a work area, uh, a logging work area here. Uh, we have some debts over here too. Come on, people. Bury the old man. All right, so we have a very light loads during summer. So, yeah, okay, I'm gonna uh, upgrade this one so I can have more population. Probably I can reach uh, 150 uh, raiders with this scenario. And let's see if we can hold defenses on every fort. Okay, my straw is just enough, 30. Maybe I have to reduce my animals. I have 40, 50, 50, and the 50 percent on the horses. Ooh, wow. that's 100. All right, just fine. That's just fine. At least I, I still have uh, 329. I don't know, 360 space. So I have something like 70 available. Uh, yeah. So let's see how many adults. Uh, we have 100, 210, 220, 230, something like that. So now I have a lot of, uh, okay, I'm going to make more steel uh, spears and uh, uh, more, what, uh, okay. I'm going to retain my steel swords. Uh, probably I will have 150 because, uh, I don't want to have a lot of uh, range units now. We'll see. I I like them to get armed with uh, a sword and um, and a uh, range uh, weapon. But you know. So I also altered the setting for the raiders to come uh, only after two more than two years. So we have chance to gather resources, prepare, rebuild. If there's any, if there's a lot of damage during the raid. Yeah, so we, re we will rebuild again here. And the game is not laggy. So we only lost one tower because our units were very good we have like uh, more melee units meaning i have more swords which is almost close to 100 something almost equivalent to the amount of raiders that came in so that was a good uh, battle over here oh this guy is sick okay lady come on it it the food sooner all right now I'm not gonna going to buy those things anymore or maybe I can okay I'm buying this and this all right I'm going to buy this one because I want to dispose my because it's low I'm going to dispose my bronze weapons and tools all right 300 that's a lot already 285 still 73 all right, 66. All right, so I still have a lot of grains, which is fine. Probably I'll just set my beer to a hundred. That is set to 33 per, uh, 50 percent, which is I don't know, 150 beers. I think that's fine. When I set my, because my food is dwindling, I don't like this way. Since I cannot make a lot of stables anymore, I feel like I don't have space for them. 
or I have to chop down these trees to accommodate more grains over here. So I have a lot of flax. I can make more, you know, it's just barley, inkern, and maybe rye. Okay, we'll get more rye over here if we can. Yeah, couple of rice over here. Yeah, I don't like to delete those uh, trees. I like it. I like those beech trees. They are green. Green and yeah. So the same settlement. Uh, ancient warrior like game. This is Canyon of Slaughter. And this is a very ancient warrior game uh, that it starts in Paleolithic. And it's a little bit more expensive. Uh, technology than uh, normal ancient warriors uh, scenario in vanilla so I think the huts over there are not being destroyed I might be able to upgrade it but I don't like to because I like those huts the huts are much more beautiful than the roundhouses to be honest I don't know where I can expand my planting so this ones i think they're not gonna get uh destroyed so i will upgrade them later okay maybe if i reach 330 population maybe okay we have some i need some tanners over here yeah whenever you have uh, a drop of uh, storage for the for the rose skins it's, it's better to make a tanner nearby. So this one, all right, let's put a tanner because we are going to make a lot of this uh, 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 leather. So our leather will be our main uh, uh, trading goods. Oh wow, look at that. We don't have tannin? Come on, how about here? All right, we'll get tannin from afar. Cause, uh, sorry. All right, we'll get this four, four tannins or five. Yeah. I know it's going to be added to the workload. Uh, um, this is. I don't know how they the mechanics on this. I have ten, so maybe one at a time. All right, we'll, we'll leave it like that. How about here, maybe okay. Maybe we have some tannin uh, plants over here. Oh yeah, we already had. I already have a gathering area. How about here? Yes, I already have. Yeah, I have a lot of tannin gathering areas already. And it's still not enough. Wow. We'll see. We will get. We'll put some more here. All right. Because uh, our leather production is a lot. Regardless if our workload is heavy, so we can have a better. So how much? Three hundred thirty-four. We managed to build another, uh, what's this, uh, roundhouse here, yep, and where did he destroy that, uh, oh, no, maybe here, alright, we will build it again, rebuild it again so they can destroy it again, alright. Alright, because I have a tanner over here too. So if they can destroy one here, that's fine. We can rebuild it. So I need to add more houses, which uh, I don't know where to. This one is not being destroyed. So the raiders come from this. Yeah, the raiders come from this side, but they don't destroy this one. Probably next time, they're going to destroy it. And then we have to rebuild this warning here. Where did we put? Okay. We have to rebuild this one here. Why not? I don't know if I'm going to put a platform though. Hmm. 
maybe I'm going to put a platform and they're not going to destroy it let's see or uh, like this one here and uh, we put a platform and then we remove the wall we will try I haven't tried this one let's see if they are going to destroy this or just a platform like a, a regular platform we will try all right all right, all right. We, will, we will see or maybe we will extend that platform okay we will try a platform though Nice, we have some stones. All right, we'll get the fish. All right, we will get this one down. Uh huh. We don't have this. Come on, it's 277. We have a lot of things to, to trade, and to be honest, we have a lot. That's it. See that 285. Okay, I'll, no, no, no. I'm not going to take this. I'll just put this one here. 277 wow look at that I have a lot and let's see how so we have how many 338 and we added to so every uh three population there will be one raider so 300 divided by 3 that is already 100 raiders plus the default maximum uh, raiders for uh, iron age up, uh, and we have 27 so 127 and we have like how many 130 We'll see how I want it. because if you are going to have a, a regular one and a half years rating then uh, we will not have enough time to prepare so kind of let's uh, I think that year one and a half year interval of rating is uh, quite uh, devastating for more than 100 raiders it's only good for less than 50 raiders so I think you guys can have your own settlement with uh, on a, from a workshop scenario and you can edit the, the files so that you can have the desired number of raiders that you wanted to accommodate every, every time there's a raid. And also you can set the immigration depending on what uh, um, what uh, the style of game you really wanted to play. 